Marnie here. It is Tuesday morning and I am feeling not a lot of energy today. Uh, I did go outside for a couple minutes uh, before it gets hot because uh, it's supposed to be 85 degrees. I know to some people that might not be hot, but to me it might as well be 100 degrees because I do not like warm weather at all. <laughs> I like my cold weather. So anyway, I'm just going to do some crocheting, have some breakfast. Uh, I'm also going to do a little bit of straightening up around here. I'm thinking about uh, getting a box together. I don't know when it will be. Um, not too awful soon, but I am going to be preparing a box uh, for a, a future giveaway. Just things that around here, uh, yarn-wise, that I know I will never use. Uh, I've got some cake yarns in the box already because I've, I've decided that I just don't particularly care for cake yarns because uh, I like to like uh, I like if I want a multicolored yarn I want it to be dispersed throughout I don't want you know like a chopped off color I don't want to have to con color control so, uh, I'm, you know, I might like the ombres in the cake yarn or uh, uh, just a variegated in a cake yarn. That would be fine. But for these, the ones that I'm going to put in the box are just regular cake yarns. I don't care for them. So, anyway, uh, that's all that's going on right now. I'm going to show a few clips from the weekend and my finished project. Uh, well, I'll go ahead and show you one of my whips now or the whip no actually one of my whips because the uh i'm still working on the shawl that is upstairs uh i'm probably maybe a quarter of a way through the last roll of yarn that i'll be using on it so anyway i'm working on another doily this is i think it's going to be pretty big uh looking at the video and i am using this ball of yarn uh, by the way crap yarn I don't like the yarn at all but I want to use it up and I am using one of these new hooks that Amy gave me thank you Amy I love this hook by the way so anyway that's what's going on right now I'm actually gonna drink a cup of coffee right now I've got uh, the sugar-free mocha, chocolate mocha in here, and it's a, uh, it's Cameron's chocolate brownie, caramel chocolate brownie, something, uh, I don't remember. <laughs> anyway, that's my coffee, and also a little bit of heavy cream in there. Alright, so, I'm going to go, I will check back in later. Easter lilies are getting close to uh, blooming soon. show off the uh, clematis. So pretty. Tomato plants. I don't know why those are laying down the way they are. Um, maybe a cat got in there. I don't know. Look, the spirea is starting to get the pink blooms on it. I can't wait until the whole thing is in bloom.
Here is my breakfast. Just two eggs, two pecan flour white bread truffles, and half of an avocado. Got some coffee here with heavy cream and MCT oil in it. Oh, there is also uh, bacon crumbles in the truffles. Here is my lunch. It is just a uh, grass-fed burger patty with uh, avocado mayo and mustard because I'm all out of my uh, homemade ketchup. And it is on two pecan flour white bread chopples. And that is lunch and I'm still working on coffee. Here is my dinner. It is just the Portofino yellowfin tuna with lemon juice and I will put some of my seasoning on there and since I had avocado for breakfast I am not doing avocado tonight so there's my apple cider vinegar drink and that is going to do it for dinner so this this one right here this peony right here was the one lonely one that was in the backyard and the rest of these are the ones that were closer to Closest to the trash can, not not the fence. And when the roses start getting a little bit heftier in bloom, then he'll start bringing those in. He always likes to have uh, fresh cut flowers next to mom's urn. Okay, here it is. I am all done with this table runner. Got it done this morning, Saturday morning. This part here was just a tad tricky, but I finally figured it out. I also got that done too. Just a really big oversized shawl. <laughs> okay, so yesterday, Monday, was my sister's birthday and I made this for her birthday. And she was here yesterday getting her birthday gift. There's my sister and my niece. And my niece got one of my little stuffies. She's got the hippo in her hand. And uh, the, the table runner looks way better on her table than it does on my folding table. So here it is on her table at home. I think it's actually gorgeous like this. <laughs> looks way better than it did on my table. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and close this day out. Uh, I'm probably going to take a nap soon. I'm getting kind of sleepy. But I did get seven hours of sleep last night. That's, that's unusual. It's very unusual for me to actually get seven hours of sleep. Uh, but I guess that's what happens when I go to bed earlier. <laughs> and I went to bed at 10 o'clock last night. Um, usually I'm I'm doing good if I go to bed by 11 o'clock. Uh, usually it's around 11.30. And every night I always say, I am going to go to bed early tonight. I'm going to be in bed. I used to be in bed by 9.30. Um, some days I'd even go to bed earlier than that. Like, well, when my mom was still alive and I was, you know, taking care of her, I would go to bed earlier or I would try to. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> So, uh, I'm going to try to do the same thing again tonight, because it was kind of nice to get seven hours of sleep. So, I'm going to go. Uh, I hope everyone has a great evening. If you could give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel, I would really appreciate that, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.